Hello everyone, welcome to the channel, it's Arad and uh, in today's Daily Dose of Tsar we are going to check into the 2nd of July 2022 and uh, if you are interested in a personal reading with me you can always go to my website uh, which link you will find in the description down below and with that said let's uh, jump into uh, today's video or how I like today's reading and the very first card we do have for the day uh, that stands as the page of uh, wands followed by the second card of the day here which represent which is represented by the sun card itself and uh, the final card of the day uh, we do have the page of uh, the ace of pentacles so I, I am sorry so the elemental dignity for the 2nd of, Ju of July stands like this Well, it seems that today the universe is going to prove us wrong uh, into our perception and opinion into a person that we already know. Uh, we already know it uh, because of the elements of dignity here into the cards, which is the uh, Page of Wands and the uh, Ace of Pentacles, uh, that elements of dignity, guys. And uh, pretty much... <clears throat> that shows the for one or another reason it's very difficult to connect to this individual and yet there is a pull all right it's just we both of us are finding a rather interesting to one another we are finding that there is something that we can give to each other whether it is a amusement you know whether it is a some kind of a passion whether it is some, some kind of knowledge it's just the extent is going to be different uh for every single one of us but at least for the time being uh something kind of pre prevented us from a connecting and having a i would say a mutual experience in fact by the look of the cards, I do believe that we do find that person annoying, aggravating, and straight out immature. Okay, like, like they are not, they, they haven't grown enough, you know, to be able to thought us anything. They haven't been grown enough to be able to kind of like make us believe into something or to show us a, a path in life for that matter but what is going to be interesting today is that by relating ourselves to that person rather like not relating but communicating in one or another way there will be a communication in between us and that individual it could be just a few sentences it could be a a whole conversation or it could be you know a date whatever floats your both uh, but through this communication couple of things are going to take place now one of them is that we are gonna become more open for everything new it's just their example is going to be very sound and if you don't live your life to the fullest why do you live your life at all that is going to be one of the examples and the other thing which is the more important thing at least uh, at least for me it is, the, it is the example that no matter what stands in front of us, we can find strengths within ourselves. Okay, so we basically through the interaction with this individual, we are going to become more um, more confident into our own personal strengths to to push our things forward. And now that I think of it's an, an example that a friend of mine used to give me. You know, uh, <clears throat> that he was saying these mothers that are lonely, right, that are alone mothers, taking care for three children, working two jobs and paying a rent and all the accommodations, these are a real heroes of our society. Okay, so that is, that kind of a strength, it is what every single one of us has within ourselves. And through the communication or the interaction uh, with, uh, with this individual page of wands, we are going to be reminded of that particular strength. That doesn't mean that we're going to need it in that particular day, right? Just through example, through what they're going through right now, uh, it's just is going to show us that the human being, that we as a human being are capable of far more than the, than the environment kind of like demands from us at that given time. And probably this situation that is going to be presented from their behalf, you know, a situation that we are not involved into, but they are, is going to make us connect more intimately. And when I say intimately, I mean to uh, at least... <clears throat> 
kind of like melt a little bit these boundaries and these obstacles, obstructions, I'm sorry, that are separating us, that are not allowing us uh, with us, with that uh, individual to share more experiences together. And um, it seems that things are going to take the natural, their natural course into that interaction, into that uh, communication. What I mean is that from this day moving forward, we're going to find ourselves more and more softening up, right? And opening up for that individual and that individual softening up and opening up for us where this is going to lead us to whether this is going to be the start of a beautiful friendship beautiful business partnership or, or maybe with a romantic incentive that is what the universe is yet to show us but for every single one of us that is going to be a natural development meaning that whatever is supposed to happen in between us and that person is going to uh, happen and we just just we just can't uh, can't force it uh, i am saying that because usually when people start falling heads over heels for a person they up until this point they paid no attention to and even they have been reposed to but you know certainly a story is said or a situation happened and that's uh, and their attitude toward that individual turns takes a turn for 180 degrees and now they are falling for that person one starts to become afraid and doubtful of thyself of thyself which is normal but there is nothing strange into that it is what i am trying to say because uh, that's the thing guys i mean every single one of us have a battle that it leads a battle which is called life that nobody else has any idea of right i mean you can you can share your stories you can you can try to express your experience but no one f can fully walk in your shoes so that's why uh the page of wands it's anything but a judgmental so they don't judge at all they just they are trying to um uh, to extract the maximum out of the given situation in term of passion and in term of uh in term of a excitement right they, they like to have a good time and it is what despite of the difficulties that that they are going through because they are going through difficulties that is from the elemental dignity it's just they are um uh, they are on the roadblock what i mean is that either something turned out to be very fragile for them in a sense of that you know it's things aren't falling apart but it turns out that they're going to be way more complicated than they, than they thought they are or it's just they straight away are hitting a roadblock and a delay you know that is pretty much gonna like i said make them open up for you and not just only for you for the whole environment another thing i want to say about the page of wands it is that they are very carefree on the outer look and they also seems like they are very detached it is like they are un disconcerned it's like no they don't they don't give a dime about anything right either you are their friend or not it doesn't make any difference for them but that's not true i mean uh, that that is just a shell right uh from within the core itself is very very fragile and everything one says they are taking it a very very personally and even though they are not showing it they kind of like change their stance and their position in regards to what people are saying and what people are doing uh things in between us under us i mean you and the page of wands me and the page of wands whoever that page of wands is i can grow to as much as as much as the universe allows it to i mean they can literally turn out into everything so uh i can tell you that if this has a potential for you to be a relationship it will be a very harmonious relationship where you you both are going to be happy because uh, kind of like there will be a contribution for each other's happiness uh, that is very common when the sun card it is next to a fire or air right <clears throat> 
in a sense of that when that person makes you happy they also feel themselves happy and same time vice versa and that way although there has to be compromises into one relationship these compromises ain't gonna feel like compromises whatsoever and uh should that be of business partnership uh when the sun is next to especially a fire card you gotta know that there will be a a lot of monetary success and uh should that be about friendship then you need to know that there is going to be a lot of a warmed, a mutual reliability. It just is going to be a friendship deprived of all kind of arguments, drama, uh, shiving into die back, right? And uh, how, how can I put it into words? A uh, betrayals as well. So with that said, this was uh, today's uh, daily for the 2nd of June, 2022. Hopefully you do enjoy it and you do like it, guys. And uh, we are to see each other next time. Until then, bye.